the most beautiful, most glamorous, and most graceful queen in history, but Stallion! Oh my god. Okay, so here is another way to mod skill points. I've known about it for a while, I just haven't made a video on it. Someone was having trouble with the last way, so I decided I'd be nice and make a new video with this way. This also works with Xbox 360. The only way to do it from Xbox 360 and probably PlayStation 3. I don't have a PlayStation 3, so I don't really know. It's probably the same steps, but Xbox is obviously a little different. Maybe you have to connect to the hard drive with PlayStation, I don't know. But for Xbox, you get a USB stick that I'm playing with right now. That's at least one gig or above, plug it into your Xbox 360, format it in the settings, and then go look for your saves in um, Borderlands, 2's, um, Borderlands 2 on the hard drive, and you copy it over to the USB. Copy as many as you need to mod, you do them one at a time, obviously. And then you plug it in after you open Horizon. You can also use Modio. I'm using Horizon because it's way easier. You can move that away from my face in case it's too loud. Move the mic away. And it's not doing anything. Amazing. Okay, sorry, my computer's. It needs to be repaired um, because registry files, and obviously, I can't pick up this internet. Uh, the wireless adapter, the driver for the wireless adapter. So once you're here, you go to Games, Borderlands, because that's a game you just copied over. Oh my god. Choose a save, double click the save, brings up this. You could just drag and drop this on your desktop to save it as a backup, which I don't actually want to use a backup. Whoops. I wanted to use this, not the backup. Because the backup is already backup. <sighs> but. You can drag, drag and drop this onto your desktop to back it up in case you mess this up somehow. And you go to contents, game, game save, or save game, extract. I just saved it to my desktop as save game. I already have one on, on my desktop as save game, so I'm not going to do that. And then from there, what you do is you open up. Gibbed. This is an older version of Gibbed because I haven't downloaded the latest one, but this works with this save because all of my saves on this computer are really old. And it will open twice because I'm impatient. Yep. So if you're doing it from PC, you open. It's in My Games, Borderlands 2, Willow Games, Save Data in your Documents. So Documents, My Game. Borderlands 2, little game, save data, and then you'll have one number that's really weird and specific. Double click it, whatever. And then you click on whichever save you're using. And if you're doing it from Xbox, you go to where you saved it. Whoop, whoops. Um, I had it in save game, so then you would hit. Actually, you'd have to do Xbox 360 and then look for it. Sorry, my bad. Because if you do Xbox 360, it'll do what it just did and deselect everything that you have selected. Then you hit open. I'm just showing you. See, then you hit save and have to go back when you're done and find it again. But I'm going to do a PC save right now. I'm going to do save 7. So, here, to get more skill points. If you have the first DLC, well, let's start with none. If you have no DLCs to raise your level cap, you do 50 and sync the XP. If you have one, you do 61. Because that raises it 11 levels, and then you sync. If you have both, you do 72. And you sync it to that level. So you'll have the XP synced up to level 72, and then you'll put the level down to 4. So every level past level 4 gets you one skill point and it'll just um... Oops. <laughs> it'll just boost you up to 72 so you'll get 68 skill points yeah something like that and then you save it and if you're on xbox you have to i'll show you what you have to do on xbox because you have to do this a few times so then you'll 
replace this with the save game from your desktop and then you'll save rehash resign and you're done you plug it back into your xbox you do that and then if you're fine with being level 72 on xbox or level 50 or whatever level level you are um just leave it or you can come back and change the level back down to whatever level you were i was level four here save this as the save seven right yes i do okay so now once you're in here the character saved you select character it saved it as a five for some reason whatever it doesn't really matter i think this character has like unlimited stuff anyways so then you select the character, you hit continue game, and I have 23 keys. Uh, just ignore that person texting me, but yeah, as you can see, I'm level 71, I should have gotten me level 72. I think maybe 71 is the cap, I don't know. It just dinged me all the way up. So I can use all these skill points to heart's content make me extremely OP you can actually do that more than once if you want to but it takes longer I would just do it the once and then take your character back down and as it levels up like if you're a low level and you do that once it should be fine oh and also um if you are planning on playing like this when you do that, you will have to drag your weapons back in because when you start, um, what happens is you start as a level 5 or 4 or whatever you did. And um, basically, you can't use a level 40 gun or shield or anything as a level 1 because that would be unfair and not make sense. Parkour. So, yeah. yeah. Oh, wow. I broke that. But, yeah. Um, basically, that's it. And we're going back to the computer part, the desktop, to do the rest of the stuff. Yeah. Okay, now, I already opened it, but I'll show you how to open it again, just in case you forgot somehow. You open the level 7, or save 7, that's the one I'm doing. And it's level 72. Now you want to take it back down to the level it was before, so you can still get skill points or whatever. Type in 44, sync it again, save it as the same save, and you'll have it good. Yes, I want to replace it. And that's pretty much it. If you want to do it just for PC with Cheat Engine, I'll put a link in the description for that. But if not, and this helped, yeah, just, you're done. Congratulations. <laughs> and I'm done, too. There's someone that just joined that's going to be infected, so be weird. Wara. Swara. 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 Can we start this? That means you can't leave me behind. Wait, oh, we were all at the wrong house. We were just standing in front of the <laughs> yeah. wrong house. Alright, protect the stairs. Alright, where you at, equal? I'm right here, behind you. People breaking in this okay. room. Okay, uh, probably get back in there. They just broke the barricades down. Yeah, that's what I was saying. Okay, they broke. close that door. Ah! Ah! Like, right <laughs> when I walk out. <laughs> <laughs> I know. So do you want to go in the room? Oh, kill him? <laughs> Is that what you were asking me when you trailed off in your sentence? No, I said, let's go upstairs. Oh, yeah, we can. Like, let's go on the roof. Yeah, let's go. Ah! Zombie! I'm stuck. That doesn't make sense! Oh, someone's shooting me! <sighs> Did you die? Green down. Yes. Did he shoot you? Oh, well, my health went down pretty damn fast. To be not shot. I mean, I'm sure he's trying to save my life, so don't kill him, but he's an idiot. I'm a black guy with a white shirt on, 
I'm on the wrong side of the fence though, but my guy's going ah. the fence. I'm stuck on someone's head. Actually, it's more beige. Dude. Now I'm walking on the of the fence. Oh. What yeah. do I do? What do I do? Jump. I can't. Jump. I can't jump. Back no. I'm so screwed. I'm so screwed. Oh my god, I made it. <laughs>